Weatherwords is a production of The Reporter, Delaware County's leading news source. Good day to everyone on Thursday the 10th. And once again, the fog is here. What does that mean? Anything that's a little bit cooler than the outside temperature is totally damp. Walk through your grass and soak your sneakers instantly and everything else. And that's waiting for what's actually going to be coming here. I'm wondering how much longer Walton's luck is going to last because in the paper it said they had confirmed three tornadoes that were investigating a fourth one. Well, the fourth one was confirmed too from this past set of storms. And it did all sorts of damage. Straight line winds toppled trees, knocked down power lines, did all sorts of stuff. And the places that got those serious storms had such heavy rain it flooded the brooks and took out pieces of road and everything else. That's the fourth time we've been missed here. It's every time I turn it on and they put these warnings up, it's like, okay, are we going to get it this time? What's coming today, hopefully, will just be heavy downpours if we get it. But it's gonna start right around lunchtime. Then there'll be a slight break. The one around lunchtime is a warm front coming through. Then this afternoon will be the same thing that happened last time. A cold front's going to come through. And that's the one that triggers all the nasty stuff. So all it says on all the different channels is keep alert to your weather radio or keep alert to the National Weather Service and see what's going to happen. Let's just hope our luck continues here. Okay? I mean, it's not like we're short of water. <laughs> the ground, even yesterday at 5 o'clock in the afternoon, the grass was still damp, believe it or not. So, I mean, you can't even go out and mow. You really can't go out and do much of anything outside. And depending on where your gardens are, things are either doing terrific or they're rotting. You've got two choices, okay? Someone yesterday offered me squash. And I said, oh, that would be nice because mine turned to gush. And it really did. I pulled it out yesterday and planted beans in the spot. And we'll get a September crop of green beans. But... It really is hit and miss for what you're planting. I will tell you it's wonderful for weeds. They seem to grow overnight, but this is really strange, okay? This morning, comfortable temperatures, believe it or not, we started at 55. However, this time of year you get up and it's getting lighter later and later. And I mean, it was quarter to six and I said, you know, pretty soon I'll have to use a flashlight to go over and see my brother in the morning. You know, it's like, Oh, well, it is that time of year. We never like to realize that's actually happening, but it is. So hopefully today won't be anything horrible, but they did say if you get one of those storms, it could be very heavy rain, quote unquote, maybe flash flooding. You know, that seems to be the thing these days. Then we're going to have a slight break, but now it looks like Saturday is going to be wet. Some showers maybe on Sunday. And then it's one of those iffies for next week, and this is the fair week next week. So we'll keep our fingers crossed that nothing serious develops during fair week. But there's no guarantees on anything anymore, so I'm just going to hope for the best. So today it's this. However, by later that'll come off, and then we'll have one clear more day, which will be Friday, and then it's back. So... Get ready to get wet again and hope for the best. Have a good one. To subscribe or advertise, call 607-464-4009.